Well, MSD has been building a massive four mile long tunnel under downtown Louisville and it's finally finished. WDRB's Travis Ragsdale goes down deep underground to show us what happens next. Right now, I'm basically underneath the Kentucky Science Center by about 200 feet. And believe it or not, after years of work, this MSD tunnel project is nearly complete. The concrete liner is 12 inches thick. The tunnel itself is 20 feet around. So this is not for everyone. You come underground 200 feet, you work here eight hours a day, there's no internet, you know, no cell phone. But after nearly three years of work, the four mile long tunnel that runs underneath downtown Louisville and the Ohio River is done and that concrete liner is in place. That puts us about 98% complete at this point with surface work as the only work that is remaining. So what's all this for? Essentially this tunnel will expand capacity for the city's stormwater and sewage overflow during heavy rains. Instead of all of that running into Beargrass Creek in the Ohio River like it does now, it will wind up here. Now what's going to happen is 98% of that's going to be picked up. So on a typical year, 439 million gallons and clean water is going to be discharged. The four mile long tunnel has a very slight decline. It only goes down by about 40 feet from one end to the other, but it will allow that extra water to flow to a treatment facility before being pumped back out into the Ohio. It's going to make the uh, rivers, the waterways clean uh, for generations to come. You know, your kids are going to be able to enjoy it, not, not having to think about uh, too much pollution. The only thing to do now, open the floodgates, literally. Right now there are bulkheads or gates in place on the existing sewers to keep flow from entering the tunnel while people are below ground working. It's going to last 100 plus years. So all in all, it's got, you know, it's a win, 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 any way you look at it. If all goes according to plan, this tunnel will become operational sometime this summer. Underneath downtown Louisville, Travis Ragsdale, WDRB News.